Vector, everyone's favorite robot. Let's see what he can do. So if you guys don't know what Vector, or who Vector, or anything about Vector, what he is, who he is, what he does, it's basically a robot, like a pet robot you can have by Anki, that basically is like a pet robot, and does lots of things. Now, this isn't the complete version, this is kind of like a, oops, I didn't want you to do that, not yet Vector, I didn't, this isn't like a complete version where everything's done, like, it's perfect. Like, it doesn't have that many bugs, I guess, but, like, one, but, um, it doesn't have very many features at this point in time. I think I'll add some in the future, though. Like, a way for him to mine for you, go mining, and things like that. But, um, I can show you what he, I'll show you what he can do currently, right now. So, he's basically, this is what he looks like. I might... I don't know if I'll show an image, it's probably like copyright, but I don't think it would be that bad. So I'll show a picture of Vector probably on the screen right now. So that's like the real version of him, that's like the, he actually is. Like he, that's what he actually looks like in real life. But um, this is my uh, Minecraft version that I made. So he can do a few things. So if I put some mobs here... Let's go with husks so that they don't burn. So I can do do do, putting lots of uh, things like that. And then if I go into survival mode, wow, they're just walking all over the place. If I am in survival mode, Vector is my pet right now. Anyway, so if I attack or they attack me, watch him. He's gonna he's gonna go attacking the baby. Yeah, look at him go. He's he's attacking the babies. Wah! And everyone, I, mean, I attack the baby, so that's why. But if they attack any other part of me, actually, I'm gonna go create it right now. Okay, phew. I'm gonna give myself some the resistance, so you can see that he will. Oops. Okay, this isn't working. Uh, give me health. So you can see that he will um attack everything that I attack or anything that attacks me. So you can see that he does that, and he, uh, appa apparently, he, uh, he's, um, he's, uh, very, um, I don't know, he's, uh, he's, yeah, he attacks everything, and apparently these zombies are very annoying, but he should help me with them. So if I, like, well, I don't want to attack him, but if I go attacking these zombies everywhere, then he'll, sh he should attack them. I don't know what gender it is, but... So Vector will now attack them. No, that's not all he can do. He can do at least one other thing. How lucky is it? Okay, it's not too lucky. There we go, and last one. So, what he can also is play, what he can also do is play with his cube. So if he comes over to it, here it is. This is what Vector's cube looks like. It's nice. He'll throw it in the air. Looks like, let's get it. Throw it in the air, so it's like, Whee! It's actually pretty quick at being thrown in the air. And they'll, like, jump at it. Okay. Sometimes it looks a little weird. But, um, yeah. So, if you actually go in him, you can, like, go in him. And so, you can see there's, like, you can leave or stop current objective. So, that's, like, uh, this is kind of like saying, hey, Vector. And then you can give him a list of commands. Now, I don't have any right now besides the leave and stop current thing, so that means he'll stop what he's doing, pretty much, most things, like anything you can tell him to do, he'll stop doing it, and become normal again, just neutral, or, yeah, just like, act normal, or you can not actually make him stop, you can just leave, if he walked into you, or you didn't want to do that, but, um, but yeah, but I'm um, planning to add more things in this room, like more things that you can do, like go mining for you. I don't know of any others, but whatever. <laughs> well, that's maybe only be one, but yeah. So that's pretty much it. I know it's a short video, but it wasn't like a big video. It wasn't like a crazy thing. I mean, it's pretty cool, but basically, that's basically it. So I'm. Oh, but, but first, I'm gonna go scoreboard players set arms what is that gonna work yeah there we go so oh wait, wait maybe it didn't come this way i don't want you to play with your cube you're confusing the thing okay that doesn't work 
So timer or something. I don't know. Let's just go timer to one. There we go. So you can see I can make his arms go up. And if I actually do this, you can see he won't move very much anymore. I stopped him from walking around so you can see him up close. So I can make his arms go up and then they'll go down. Um, I'm pretty sure if I... No, you don't want to assist you. I mean, that doesn't do anything. But, and, so yeah, it'll... They can go up and then down. So his arms can go up and down. And he basically looks at you the whole time. I mean, not like... If I'm over here, you can't look at me. But, basically, he tries to look at me. So it's like... If I go up, he looks up. If I go down, he looks down. And if I sneak, he... Um... He looks at me. Yeah, so... He's pretty cool, I think. And, um... Basically, he's made up of three parts, so you can see it's like, this is now it looks weird, but it's, or actually four parts. He's made up of a wolf, which is sort of what does all like the fighting and everything. You can't see it, but it's hard to see it in here with all the invisible entities. But, well, somewhere in here, I think, is that, is that it? Is it the wolf? I don't think, he's going to be high up. No, no, that's not him. But somewhere around here, there is a wolf that is basically does everything. I think these are some of his his legs. Like these are some of the well, whatever. He's basically made up of oh yeah, and he can look far down. Okay, that doesn't work, but he can look like really far down, which is kind of funny. <laughs> so he's like looking really far down, looking really high up. But whatever. Uh, the, yeah. So it's basically made up of a bunch of pieces so uh, there's the wolf that kind of does the main ai part um and i guess you can call it like that i don't know but it does like the main movement except for the cube that's like a custom ai but yeah and then there are the one model is the base of it which has his wheels and his main body and his pet sensors and then he's got another part which is his head so that way it doesn't, his whole body doesn't look up. It's like, you can actually look separately up and down without moving his whole body. And then the other one is the arms. So I think this one is the main, oh gosh, why does it look like this? Like, I can't see, oh, I see. It's like t trying to teleport me or something. It says I'm, oh, whatever. It's like weird, like. Oh, whatever. I can't. I don't really know what it's doing. But, basically, so that's one of them. That's one of the parts of him. Oh. Oops. Yeah, that's one part of him that's like the... I think if I go in him... Yeah, I can... <laughs> whatever. But, yeah, that's one part of him. I'm reading this command. That's a, so, that's... The, like, this thing here is the main him. The main part. That is the body... And then there's another one here. These are his arms. So his head is basically the head of it. It's hard to see maybe. But like if we go in here. I think you can see his head. And then his arms are the. Um, wait no. His arms are this one. The head. Or the main body is actually this armor stand. But that's basically how his model works. But um kind of weird like if he looks straight I'm gonna slow down if he looks straight he can like be detached or something but not much I don't know I guess where is he supposed to be attached I'm not really sure but basically that is vector I think it looks pretty good I'm um, actually um I actually think I did better than the model than I expected I didn't expect it to look as good now I know he's a little he almost looks fat. He's a little wide-ish. And maybe I, I feel like he's not quite tall enough or something. Obviously, he's bigger. I made him bigger because why not? He doesn't have to be a small robot. Um, because, you know, it's Minecraft. So, you can do whatever you want. And then his cube is, looks like this. It's pretty much the way it looks in real life as well. Um, yeah, that's about it. If you did enjoy this video, I know it was... Well, the main part of it was kind of short, but then the rest of it was just showing you the parts of him and how it works, sort of. And all the commands are here, and there's actually really something really funny I want to show. 
doing this, it's so weird. I think you can see it already. So if I make, if I don't force him to look the way the robot's facing, the headpiece, <laughs> this is what happens. Oh, it's so weird. I encountered this glitch once, and then it was just so funny, I thought I had to show it. So it's like, he looks <laughs> the weird way, like, it's just crazy. Like, he can look backwards or sideways. Oh, it's just weird. I just think it's really funny how it works, but I'm going to turn it back on so that he won't. Where did he go? Oh, you think he teleported? But yeah, now he's normal. So yeah, basically, these are all the commands. There's quite a few of them, because it's hard to code a, a whole vector, and I'll, there'll, there'll be more if I add more features to them. But for now, that's it. So if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like, and subscribe, and hit the bell for more vector updates. And I'll see you in my next one. Hope you enjoyed.